Welcome back today guys to the channel top 10 drifts of the week is back on this Friday man This is actually week number two here on 2024 and we still have our BenQ Mobius gaming monitor giveaway up for grabs once again If you guys missed last episode make sure you guys go ahead check that out down below But today though we're here for another round of top 10 clips before we do though a little housekeeping up for grabs is our BenQ EX32 10U this is a 4k gaming monitor a stunning one millisecond response time out here built-in speakers microphone you have the HDRI the color shuttle to maximize that gaming experience there will be three ways to enter in one of which is the gleam links found down below second will be to actually enter in your clips if you are showcased in top 10 drifts uh, you will be entered into the giveaway so anybody that you do see here with their names in the top right of the screen will be entered in and three uh, just comment down below top 10 drifts that's all you need to do and I'll be pinning one lucky winner in about three to four days last episode we had Brenton Griffin jr. top 10 drifts finally back let's go so he's gonna be entered in to the giveaway as well and then, like I said we will be pulling the winner at the end of the month uh, to be receiving a brand new BenQ Mobius gaming monitor. And just a huge thank you to BenQ, but uh, top 10 drifts though. We're back today for week number two here in 2024. I'm excited. I had a lot of comments last episode how excited they were to have the series back. A lot of people really enjoyed it, really missed it as well too here on the channel. So we're back today to go over how to submit your clips. It's very simple. Discord links are found down below. Enter into the Discord, you're going to find a top 10 links category on the left, and you're going to go ahead and submit your clips, whether it be YouTube, just the file itself, I can pull them right off the Discord. I'm excited, and I'm here for the long haul, man. Starting us off number 10 with Grand Theft Auto 5 from Lad NST with a huge entry going the other way. He said, you know what, I'm going the opposite direction, I need to hit a quick little U-turn, and he does exactly that, outlining the curb with the tire. You can't get any closer than that. You really can't out there. That's Monaco almost basically then. Number nine, Elreza 8008 with some ride four maybe. I think this is what this is. It's a very difficult game to get correct. And the fact that this man is sliding around here is very impressive, right? I love seeing these two wheel clips slide in here. And uh, hopefully, have, have we ever seen a bike tandem before? I don't think that's ever been a thing, is it? There should be some bike tandems. That's all I'm saying, man. Number eight this week, we have Ivan with a massive entry here on Live for Speed. Now, I don't know exactly what corner this is, but the man tossed it. And I didn't really know this before I set all this up, but you will see Ivan a couple more times before the end of the episode. He just has been sending in good quality clips, right? If you guys have not already, submit your clips to be also entered in the top 10. And right, I mean, there's no count. If I like the clip, it's going in. Sometimes I don't even notice it until I'm going through the editing and I'm noticing that it's the same person sometimes, right? I just I just pick the clip sometimes, right? We have La DV with a massive reverse 360 tandem. It took him a couple times to get right. The second pass though, holding it down for number seven quite nicely this week. For number six this week, a set of Corsa R35 Rocket Bunny kit. And uh, this has no business being as clean as it is. It really, uh, just the transitions back and forth. It's a super clean edit. The driving is also really nice. And uh, I just appreciated the fact that uh, he was holding that outside line, like all the way around. It's a nice clip, man. Really do appreciate everybody throwing in consistency on the clips as well too. And you know, the length of the clips also do matter, right? The difficulty of the clip, how many cars are in there, the creativity, and just overall, how gnarly is it, right? That man is holding that outside line. Beautiful clip. Location's nice, demonic, with a huge clip for number six. Number five this week, live for speed. Rolling back in here, man. I gotta get back onto this game. We have Ivan once again for his second appearance here this week with a massive entry. He makes it look good. The creativity of these clips. I don't think I've ever actually seen this angle before on this track. I didn't even know that this spot existed. You can't get any closer. Where's his bumper? Right? Beautiful clip. Love to see Live for Speed back in. Number four this week, Forza Horizon 5, King Smill 5050 with a massive entry, cruising the back roads, and he is tossing some serious speed. Look at 105, I think he got that up to. That's miles per hour, also to note. And he's going to go ahead and toss a reverse 360 into it. Second gear, keeps it slot right. That's a nice clip, man. That is a beautiful, clean clip. Number three, we have Rizzoa. He's back, man. I haven't seen this man 
in years on top 10. Last time we did top 10, he was probably in here. He's been so consistent with the clips. Huge thank you for sending this in. Going backwards on the Nuremberg ring, hit the outside carousel. I don't think it gets any better than that. He's still going here. 90 coming down, and he's gonna go for a massive toss. I need to get on this section, right? I forgot about the days of just exploring the track, whether it be backwards or forwards, looking for that perfect layout. The Nordschleife definitely has a couple, I feel like, right? Jeez, man, number two this week, Ivan! He's back, man! I couldn't believe it when I did it. I honestly, I didn't set this up in any way. This man got three entries into the giveaway somehow this week. Consistency, like I said, the man's dropping good clips. I asked for clips, he gave me clips. Feel like if you guys haven't already, submit your clips. Beautiful tandems here with Weld, and uh, he's tossing another Live for Speed clip again. Makes me kind of hungry to play this game, man. If you guys are still on Live for Speed, let me know in the comment section down below. Give me a Live for Speed one time in the comments for me, right? Now, this is another vote for number one. Let me know in the comments section down below who you think should take home number one. We had on D1GP. I'm almost certain with a crazy two-wheel. After some contact, the panels flying off the cars. I didn't even know that was possible. We definitely need to slow-mo this one time. Right now, I haven't played this game in probably about eight years, I want to say. I have it sitting next to me on my PS2, waiting to go in. Maybe I should make a return on D1GP. This is probably one of the hardest drifting games known to man, I feel like, right? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below. Do you want to see it for a couple episodes? But going head-to-head, -head, though, this week, number one, we have Fate with a full wheel setup here on, I do believe, the Shotoko. If you haven't already joined up to the NoHezzy servers, make sure you guys go ahead, click the link down below. I have my own affiliate link now. This man is cutting through traffic sideways in his Dodge Charger. I don't know how these people make it look so smooth out here. I do have a brand new adapter so I can actually use my purple wheel and not have to worry about my adapter breaking anymore because it's fully aluminum. So I'm excited to hopefully do what this man's doing and tossing a 360, man. Huge thank you to everybody that submitted a clip this week. Very impressive, right? It's good to be back here on Top 10 Drifts. I feel like it has been way too long. And with the ease and simplicity of Discord, I definitely feel like we're gonna be back, we're gonna be here to stay. And if you guys have not already submit your clips, like I said, the Discord links are found down below for you guys to get into. Right now, we had a huge amount of entries in from last week, so huge thank you to everybody. I still have yet to go through all of them. So if you haven't already, submit your clip for next week. We have two more weeks before the giveaway of our beautiful BenQ 3210U 4K gaming monitor. It's a mouthful, but it's beautiful though, man. BenQ, Mobius Gaming, Huge thank you once again. Right, I've also been using the BenQ monitors as well myself. Absolutely love them. The built-in speakers, probably one of my favorite features on the monitor, because it's very rare nowadays to find a monitor with built-in speakers. And they're good. I haven't had really a need to go any louder than what I do. If I am, I'm on my headphones, right? So it's a really good setup. Make sure you guys go ahead, click those links to enter into the giveaway. I cannot stress it enough. It's an easy entry, and I think it's here to stay for the giveaways moving forward. Huge thank you once again. But like I said, if you haven't already, top 10 drifts, comment down below, gleam, or just enter in your clips. Discord links are found down below. Right, top 10 drifts of the week, week two, 2024. Huge thanks for watching. I'll see you guys back here tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.